Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Legacy Challenge. I am getting Gino up as of right now because Niklaus is crying. So we definitely need to go ahead and take care of that. But while he is... What the heck? While he's getting up um, and coming on over here, I'm going to show you just a couple things that I did to the house. <coughs> Excuse me. So I split this up into two little bedrooms that will become the children's bedrooms when they age up into children. Um, but until then, it's kind of just going to stay blank. And it's Elijah's birthday today. And Mittens. I already knew that. Alright, so I did that. And I did that for the reason that this room here could become like their bathroom. I didn't think about it though. I don't... It'll just be like close to their bedroom, I guess, and that's why it'll be their bathroom. Plus, there's no shower over there, so that one can't really count, obviously. Um, let me just click for him, what he has to do with her when he is done with Niklaus. Come on, Gino. Look how muscular he is. I never realized how muscular he really was. And he only has one athletic, so... He must have been made that way, like, in EA's terms. Alright, so, Mittens wants to socialize with Elijah. Where is Elijah? Well then, go ahead and socialize. You really need to use the bathroom. What are you doing at the toilet? Oh my god, what are you doing? Ew, he's drinking! That is disgusting. Look at it. Yeah, that is a pig. Drink from the toilet. Did you not just do that? Why is that locked in? That's just disgusting. Alright, Bonnie is still sleeping here. But what I went ahead and did is I moved around their room. I gave them where their bathroom used to be. I moved it into, like, the dressing room. Um, I want to put um, the baby's changing table in here. And I was thinking, if I wanted to, I could always make this the nursery at one point or another. And put, like, the cribs in here and then move this, like, over. But for right now, I'm just going to keep it there. I then added in a small sitting area, which has the TV of the house for right now. Because we don't have a TV, so it would be nice for them to be able to just sit down and relax in front of the TV sometimes. And then I moved... Oh, shoot. I moved there bathroom here but I forgot to put the roof on so just gonna do that quickly now alright that's good so I put the room their bathroom here and I just kept the same stuff I just pretty much moved it and that was pretty much it but I thought it came out pretty well and I liked that they could have like a little sitting area even though it's not huge you know it's still a sitting area that they can use so I did like that. Alright, put Charity. What? Oh, it says crib. I thought it said chub. And I was like, what? And then I'm going to send him back to sleep because he's actually pretty tired. Bonnie is actually going to be getting up. So I'm going to have her come in here and use this. And then go ahead and take a bath. I do want to add a shower in where this toilet is. And move this toilet here. And just kind of put a rug in the center. That was my plans, but I ran out of money, as you can tell, so I couldn't really do that. So that was kind of annoying to me because I definitely wanted to do that, but I'll have to wait until I just get a bit more money before I can do that. But that's okay. Alright. So let's see. Oh, what's wrong with Niklaus? Oh, he's sleeping, though. I would get him to come over here and take care of him, but I'm just going to let him sleep. And then Bonnie can go ahead and take care of it when she gets up. Because I'm not going to make Gino come over here and take care of it now. He's tired. He just needs to go to sleep. And I kind of feel bad having to wake him up. But he, she was, like, totally exhausted. So I made sure that he got up instead of her. All right, I'm going to get a light. No... I'm going to get Elijah to come over here and sleep. Um, is that Elijah? No, Jax. Mips, I'm going to have sleep here. Um, 
he can sleep down here. Thank God these guys are aging up today because um, I kind of say, what are you doing? Are you have to work today in five hours? Go to sleep. I'll tell you when to get up to get your stuff done. Don't be worrying about that. Yes, Bonnie, you're going to get some food. But first, you need to take care of your bathroom needs. All right. I don't even remember what I was saying now. Shoot. Um, I don't know. Something, but that's okay. All right. So she needs to also water the plants. But with it always raining out now, we're not going to be watering no plants. I also wanted to mention that there's only two days left until winter, so we'll be seeing snow fly in here pretty soon, so we, uh, we're pretty lucky that we got this much of a house built, because I, at the beginning of this game, thought I was never going to get any money, and I thought I was going to, like, die of freezing to death, but I didn't, and that was really good. Will you get over here and sleep? <coughs> I did not tell you to sleep there. All right, everyone should be should be good. Let's have you go sleep here when you're done eating. Bonnie's finishing up her bath. Um, what is her job? Oh yeah, painting. We need to get her going on that because she's only at level four. He is a chef. He's in the culinary career, but he also is on level nine. So. He makes a lot of money. When he gets up, he ne also needs to go ahead and do what I just had her do. And then, since she's got those hot dogs, I want to make sure that there's some in here left for him. And there's not. So, Bonnie, you're going to have to cook your husband some dinner because, well, it's really going to be lunch. Because he's going to starve if you don't. When he only has three hours left, I'm going to wake him up, which is probably now, isn't it? Mm, we'll give him... Yeah, we'll wake him up. Bonnie, you need to take care of Niklaus. And then we're going to have you go ahead and um, bake or cook your husband some food. Since you did eat his the last plate of food. Though you were starving, so can't... You know, he has 76 more days. And she only has... 17 before she's an adult. He has so many more days in her. Are any of these babies? No, they're both human. I was going to ask, I was wondering if any of them were um, a fairy, but they're not. I don't, I didn't remember, so I had to check. Come on, get over here and sleep. Stop wandering around the house and do what I say. All right, let's get you to go ahead and put Niklaus back in the crib. And then let's go ahead and get you to serve up some, hmm. Let's have you serve some peanut butter and jelly. Yeah, he'll be in here a bit because he's got to take a bath. But this should do pretty good. Uh-oh. I hope she gets that made pretty quickly. Or we'll just have to have him have a quick meal if she's not done at like 20 after. And it doesn't look like she's going to be done. <sighs> Hurry, Bonnie. Put the baby down. <laughs> Back away from the baby. Yeah, and Charity's still sleeping, so we don't really got to worry about her quite yet. Which, Niklaus, now he's perfectly fine. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to have him grab a plate or a quick meal, but we'll see. Bonnie, let's go. <laughs> Stop tapping your foot. Gino, can you clean this up before you get something to eat? No, never mind. I'm just going to have you eat something quick. Because if I don't have him eat something, he's going to be starving all day. Have a quick meal of canned soup. You look so different. <laughs> what happened to your hair? 
All right, and his carpool is here already, so that really stinks. But I'm glad we at least got him all taken care of. Oh, my girl, you need to clean house. You also need to unclog that and recycle that. And now I'm going to put the walls down so I can get this stuff. Ooh, we do have gifts to accept, so I'm going to go ahead and accept them here. Gino, seriously, buddy. Let's go. It's like 2.30, and you have to be to work by 3. Yeah, you're going to be late. Is it really raining on them? On him? Alright, Gino, come on. You're full. Let's go. Alright, she's going to go ahead and take care of the bathroom. And I need her to go ahead and put away those leftovers as well. Yeah, I know it's broken. That's what happens when you use it. Alright, Gino, let's go. Why are you going this way? You're just making your life harder than it really should be. <sighs> Did that car leave you? <laughs> I was going to say. I'd be really angry. He was on his way. Alright, what does he need for work? He needs coworkers, boss, cooking, and mood. So... Let's go ahead and have you meet your coworkers because that'll help with that. Jeez, we are like flying. It's driving my eyes nuts. I'm getting out of there. <laughs> that was crazy. That was crazy fast. Okay, so she's going to go ahead and take care of the newspaper and take care of getting the gifts. Then little Charity needs some attention. So let's go ahead and get her to take care of her. I don't know how Niklaus is doing, but we'll see. Oh, he's fine. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> don't worry about him today. Um, all right, let's start from mm, here. This is from Victoria one one six six seven. This is the message from the game, and we got a sun disc. What is this for? What do you do with this? Um, oh, you hang it on your wall. All right, so thank you so much for the sun disc. And I'm going to go ahead and send you back a gift. Is it not? Is it clicked there? No. Thanks for the... S wow, I can't spell today. The sun disc for Bonnie in my legacy. Alright, so thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and send that back to you. This is the same person. So, hmm. This is from Meester. Um, use this for any LP of your choosing or even a free play game. I just want my bestie to have a little something extra too. Good luck. Aw, thank you so much. And I'm going to go ahead and accept that. <gasps> Ooh, I love this. I love to put it on my dining room table. Thank you so much for the modern orchid. All right, I'm going to go ahead and send you back a good package. Thanks for that, bestie. I got a modern orchid for Bonnie in my... Legacy. I am going to place it on my. No, place it on. Yeah, my. Dinging. <laughs> dining room table. Alright, thank you so much. And I will save. Well, the bottom two are for Derek. So I can't accept those. And then these three are from the same person. So I'll try and take one in different LPs. So thank you so much for that. It does mean a lot to us that, you know, you are sending us gifts. It's a good idea to be prepared. Aw, look at that's Cam. You guys probably can't really see him. He's so tiny up there, but cute. Alright, so she's going to go ahead and take care of 
charity. Let's see. What do these cats need? You need the bathroom. Stop scratching and get over here and use this bathroom. I don't know why you guys won't just sleep on this thing. Can you please just sleep here? You need to eat. Get over here and eat from your bowl. And you, what are you doing? Scratching? You do not need to scratch. How about you just sleep? Alright, Bonnie. You can put charity back when you're done. And then, that's not you. Then I'm going to have you go ahead and clean up all these plates and bowls. And then, you already took care of all this, which is good. Any of these counters need to be cleaned? Yes. Let's get that done. Let's get you to make the bed. I just pretty much want her to clean the whole house because I don't even know the last time that we went through and cleaned anything, so who knows how dirty stuff is. All right, so let's go ahead and have her do that. She wants to meet a pet. I don't know how you're going to meet someone, but okay. He doesn't want anything. He just wants to be a lazy bum bum all day. That's what he's going to do. Lazy bum bum up here. All right, Elijah, when you're done, you need to use scratch. Bonnie, you need to clean these as well. You got your work set out for you. All right. He's still meeting coworkers, but his his uh, performance is going up, so that's a good thing. It's not going down, which you don't want it to go down. Because then we won't get a, pro a promotion. I want to buy another easel so they could both be learning it. So I could put one here and one there. But mm, I don't know. We have things we need to buy for the babies when they become te toddlers. Like the potty and stuff like that. But um, hmm, we don't really have money now. Well, we will when he gets home, I guess. Because he's making $201 an hour. So we'll definitely be getting some money. And he's working for five hours. So, a little over a thousand should be what we make, which is really good. So, I'm happy about that. Now it doesn't say he's going up anymore. Oh, because he's starved for mood light. Aw. Poor guy. Alright, so she's got stuff in here that they can eat. We should make gourmet cat food. That would be the best thing. But I don't want to pay $45 for that either. All right, so it says catfish for the chef. The chef is experimenting with recipes involving fish. The only problem is that he doesn't have any fish. Use this cheese as bait to catch an alley catfish. Then turn it into the restaurant. But hurry, the chef promises to pay top simalone. So he has to catch any alley catfish using the cheese as bait, then return to work with the fish for a cash reward. All right, let's have him do that tonight. Since he's not, like, exhausted, he could go here after work. Where's the entrance to this place? I don't even know. Where do you enter this place? Seriously. It's, like, over here on the stairs, and I'm just missing it. Anyways, where do the fish jump? Hmm. I thought there was one over here. Oh, no, right here. So we're going to have him go here when he's done. And that way, he can just go fish straight to fishing. All right, Bonnie, how's things going at home? All right, she's got a couple more things to do, and then she'll be pretty d much done with the house. Um, she's got the cat boxes and a plate that need to still be worked on. But other than that, she's doing pretty good. Will you get over here and sleep? Jax is sleeping perfectly fine. He's doing great. And Elijah, you need to play with something. So can you play with this? Mittens, you're fine. You're sleeping. I'm not going to worry about you. All right, what's happening over here? Learning the basics of any skill. Aw, she's so cute. This is actually a house that I built for her, but I love it. And she loves it. <laughs> Oh, Niklaus, what do you need now? All right, Bonnie, you got a baby to take care of. You need to give him a bottle. Go ahead and change his diaper. Go ahead and snuggle him and play with him. 
And then go ahead and snuggle him again. All right, he should be getting out. He didn't go up as high as I had hoped, but that's okay. He has met Simona Valencia at work. Okay. No, I want you to go where I told you to go. Why do you not understand me? Seriously, go here. Bonnie, what are you doing? Oh, it's, uh, the cat's birth. It's Elijah's birthday. Aww. Alright, he's left work and made $829. Oh, no. Aw, look at him. Okay, another birthday. Babies are crying galore. But we need to celebrate their birthdays. Go here. Alright. The Mitten's birthday now. And Elijah Cat became an adult. What are the cats doing? Are they going to celebrate the birthday? I think so. They all look exactly the same. I'm not even joking. Alright, so Mittens and Elijah are now aged up. Into big boys and girls, or are they both boys? <laughs> They're both boys. We have... Mips is the only girl we have. Well, that's fine. Alright, Bonnie. Seriously, these babies need to be taken care of. All right, let's go ahead and have you change his dirty diaper. Give him a bottle. Go ahead and snuggle him. All right, so that's fine. Let's share that quickly that Mittens also became an adult. Are you actually already over here? Holy Moses. <laughs> Holy Moses. All right, let's go ahead and choose bait. We're going to choose the cheese. Go ahead and start catching now. <laughs> Go! He stands in the trees and fishes. Hmm. Maybe that's a technique. Alright. Alright, she's got one of them to stop crying, hopefully. Probably not. Change her dirty diaper. Go ahead and give her a bottle. Go ahead and snuggle her. And that should take care of them. What are you doing? Stop doing that. Get over here and eat. These cats need some attention. Mittens. What are you doing? You're being pounced on. Random. <laughs> you want to learn the hunting skill? We'll do that. The cats and cats don't really get any wishes, I don't feel. All right. Are you done with that baby yet? He just caught a toad. That's not what we're looking for, buddy. Keep going. All right, buddy. Come on. The crying is getting a little insistent now. Then let's have you go ahead and put Charity back. And then you can come over here and use this bathroom. And grab a plate of the peanut butter and jelly that you made. Alright. Are you two, like, done eating? Yeah, you are. Alright, let's go ahead and have you chat it up with, um... Chat it up with Jax just to get your guys' social up because both of you need social. What are you doing? Stop it. You both are driving me crazy. Socialize with one another. There. That'll keep you all company forever. He's caught a goldfish. Okay, seriously? Catch an alley catfish and you'll be done. Oh yeah, and I did extend this room down one bit just so that it didn't look so weird, but 
figured that wasn't really a big deal. He got a rainbow trout. Okay, seriously, he really needs to catch the alley catfish. Um, yeah, after she's done, I'm going to go ahead and send her to sleep because the babies are taken care of now. And when he is done messing around with the fish, he's caught a minnow. Seriously, do you know? You're going to play this little... You have two skills in fishing and can't catch an alley catfish. This is a definite issue. <laughs> Let's go. He says, not the cheese. Not the cheese. He lost his last bit of cheese. He is fishing with no bait. He should choose new bait or go buy some more at the supermarket. Well. I don't even see the fish jumping there anymore. I think you already got them all. What's over here? Anything jumping over here? Uh, I don't see anything. How about over here? I don't see anything there either. Gino, seriously. When do you have to have this done by? Thursday. Go home. It's only Monday. Alright. He has caught some stuff. He caught three toads, one goldfish, one minnow, and one rainbow trout. He just never decided to catch the alley catfish that we needed. So, you know, good days. Alright. Oh, jeez. I'm going to have him come in and eat because he is really hungry. But when he's done, he needs to clean up all these dishes. Because she's not doing it. What is wrong with these hot dogs? No interactions are available. Okay. You're going to greet him. You're going to greet him. Jeez. You're going to greet him. Dang, boys. Alright. Oh, now you can clean it all up. What the heck? I don't get it. Alright. You got quite the greeting when you came home. Oh. Accuse of cheating? Stop it. He is not cheating on you. <sighs> she's going to ruin this relationship because she's being an idiot. And if you have never heard that word, well, it's from Supernatural and the TV show. And the guy says it to the younger folks in the show all the time. Bobby is his name that says it. And my husband was just watching Supernatural, even though it was one of the newer ones, which I'm not going to give any spoilers out, but uh, it wasn't said in that video, but it just I'm at the part where he always says it, so oh, it's a better word for saying the other one. <laughs> it's better than that. Aw, her little babies are coming. Everyone wish her congratulations in the comments. She wants to have opposite sex twins. Um, so we are hoping for them. That's why I wrote fingers crossed. Alright, you got all those plates picked up? Good. Good work. When these babies become toddlers, we have to paint their picture. Thank God Bonnie can do it, but he needs to do Bonnie's as well before she passes on. I'd really like it to be, you know, like her adult stage. So he's going to have to really start working on this. And he has Monday through Thursday off, which is great because it helps with the babies, especially since we have tod twins. But, um, yeah, I'm not too happy about that. Alright, so when he gets up, I'm going to go ahead and have him use and take a bath. Because he'll probably need to, or I just will do it because they both really need to. Okay, seriously, stop trying to accuse him of cheating. He did not cheat on you just because he has a love interest with someone else. That was 
before your time. Okay. Oh, these cats. Why did you not socialize with the cat I told you to socialize with? Let's get you over here to socialize with this cat then. If you won't listen to me the first time, you'll listen to me the second time. Alright, mittens. Mittens, get over here and eat. You're going to socialize with Mips, and then I'll have you do something else. Oh. What is wrong with you, Niklaus? All right, I'm going to get her up to come over here and take care of Niklaus. She needs to give him a bottle and get, change his diaper, snuggle him, play with him, and snuggle him. So come on, stop that stupid shit. And I'm going to get Gino to go out and get rid of this love interest before she keeps trying to accuse him. Because that's just ridiculous. There's no reason for that. If I had the clean slate, I would use it right now. But I honestly think it's like 20,000. Yeah, 25,000. Wow, he needs a lot more then. Just keep him separated and everything will be fine. <laughs> Now she's debating on a third name if it's triplets. Alright. Go ahead and put Niklaus in there. I don't know if... Yeah, she's going to need some attention as well. So let's go ahead and get her to just take care of her too. While she's in here, she might as well take care of them both. And let's see. He's probably going to need more attention because... Jeez. Um. Oh, she had her baby. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know who this lady is. I've not been able to see her since. I do remember trying to get rid of her as a love interest before, and it didn't work. I don't know what happened, but I couldn't, like, get her to come home. Oh, I hope she had twins. Um. Alright. Yeah. It's kind of stupid to put him back, but you know what? We're going to do it anyways. And we're going to take care of her, too, because she's already taking care of her bladder plus she really needs social so I'm gonna go ahead and take care of her which is gonna make Niklaus cry because he's got a dirty diaper no nope, he's gonna fall asleep okay that's fine with me so I'm gonna do that alright then you know what you can put charity back because she'll be fine by then that diaper change will boost this up and this up so it'll make her happy. <laughs> Alright, I'm looking to see what she's got. Um, but I haven't seen if she's had twins or not. So, we only have one day until winter. And I do believe today is the baby's birthdays. Yeah, Niklaus and Charity will be toddlers by the end of today. Which gives us exactly seven weeks to paint their pi er, seven weeks. Seven days to paint their picture because that's all that they have. So that could be a little scary. You want to scratch the scratching post, then. Oh, she's too tired. Then get over here and sleep, silly. All right, let's see. Bonnie, I need you to get over here, and I need you to change his dirty diaper. And then go ahead and snuggle him before you put him back to bed, because that's just a nice thing to do. I'm going to have him. No, not survey. I want you to come over here and sleep. Mittens. You need to use this bathroom. 
There she is. And you can then sleep here. And Elijah, I'm going to have you use this bathroom. And then I'm going to have you sleep in here. All right, it's Niklaus's birthday and Charity's birthday, which we already knew, so that's no big news. All right, put Niklaus back. Then I'm going to have you go ahead and sleep and use and take a bath and go ahead and eat the leftovers. Once Bonnie gets into bed, I'm going to have him get up and go find this girl. I'm actually going to have him invite her out. And we're going to go with him, and we're going to break this up and make them just friends. If she does not accept to go out with us, I'm going to get really mad. <laughs> because I've been trying so hard to get rid of that, and it just doesn't want to let me. So it's, if it's going to ruin my relationship, I'm not going to be happy. Because I really like these two together. And you guys know how long it took me to have Bonnie find someone who was, like, you know, acceptable. So... Let's hope. All right, Gino, come on. I'm going to fast forward you guys because you guys are going to be in here forever. <laughs> it says that um, Cammie's dad has went after a younger lady. <laughs> she wrote, ooh la la. But, um, yeah, um... The whole thing is behind Cammie is the reason that I know her characters and I built the house for her is because she is in, um, if you guys read it, it's on Facebook, I write a story, and Cammie, well her real name is Kamira and Cam are in the story with their children, and uh, we have been planning out her father's appearance and some other things, so... It's pretty exciting. Alright, I'm going to get him up. Because I want him to go take care of this, like, now. Before she even gets up out of bed. Because if she gets up and he's here, you know she's going to go right to him. And she's going to get all upset. And you know what? I'm not even going to worry about the bath. You just, you know what? Don't even worry about that either. Just invite this girl out. We'll come home and take care of the rest. Come on, buddy thing that gets me is she can still sleep in the same bed as him, even though she's mad that he supposedly cheated, but he didn't even cheat, which is what makes me even more mad because it's not even his fault. It's her. It's it's something that was there before these two even got into a relationship. Oh, this really gets me. All right, from one chef to another. Camillo Mancini, a fellow chef, would like to discuss cooking with you to see if there are some tips to be gleaned from your culinary cranium. Meet up with Camillo Mancini to socialize and share cooking tips, and you might walk away with a few cooking tips and a relationship boost. All right, we'll go ahead and do that as well. We just need to get him out of the house. Sure, that sounds like fun. Let's meet there. Okay, Gino, this is your opportunity to get rid of this Jalissa Rivers as your love interest to keep your relationship well. So we need to go. You look a lot like Camillo Mancini, which is actually someone who Bonnie was after as well. See, they look a lot alike. He just wears sunglasses and he doesn't. But if Bonnie is going to accuse him, it's going to ruin their relationship as husband and wife. So we need to get rid of this like now. Oh yeah, I forgot he had a really fast car. I'm going to zoom out so we can kind of see more of the town as we go. It's a really nice town. It's so pretty. Even knowing it's like almost winter, it's so pretty. So, all right, this is her. I am going to come right on over here. We are going to be mean and ask to be just friends. There. Go ahead. Just forget about going to the lot. Let's go. No. Gino. Ask her to be just friends. Don't chat. In real life, you know that meeting up with your, like, ex-love interest would never end well with your relationship. Come on.
fine. Chat it up and then ask her to be just friends. And you better ask her. I mean it. No. Gino, knock it off. <laughs> Oh, she's mad. She is really mad. Well, you know what, lady? He's married. You know what? So, calm down. And you know what? You guys can't even talk. So, he lost a friend. Well, you're supposed to become just friends, so I do not understand that at all. But, okay. He think She thinks Gino is being unforgivably rude. I think you're being unforgivably rude. He's trying to save his relationship, lady. You don't even understand. He has kids now. <laughs> we're, like, taking it out on her. But it's not her fault. I mean, they were in this relationship before Bonnie got with him. It's just the point that Bonnie finds it wrong that he still has feelings for her. But you know Sims. <laughs> you know Sims. All right, he's going to have some things to cut. What about you? Do you have anything that we should be knowing of? Hmm. I don't see anything. Okay. That's good. That is good. He just caught a rodent. Yucky doodles. That is so gross. I would never walk up to a rodent and pick it up. I'm sorry, but I just wouldn't. I know I just wouldn't. All right, let's get you over to here and cut some gems. I know we got at least two now. And then, hmm. Then you can go home. What are you ranting about? <laughs> She's ranting about a broken heart. Oh, that's too funny because we're the one that broke it. <laughs> well, it's not funny. It's just we don't want this relationship to be screwed up because of that. So I'm trying to fix that. All right, these babies, seriously. All right, Bonnie, let's go. Your turn again. Change the diaper. Go ahead and give a bottle. Go ahead and snuggle and play with and snuggle again. Gino is cutting those gems right now. Bloodstone and let's just do emerald. And I know it's not the really expensive one, and I think she actually knows them all. Does she know them all? Anyways, if if she does, oh well. We're just trying to get them cut. Oh, before you come home, we're going to sell them too. Okay, calm down, child. We're here. Hopefully she does not accuse him of cheating now that, you know, he's broke that off. Let's hope. All right, put Charity back. Change diaper. Give bottle. That'll keep you busy for a bit. Let's jump over to him quickly so that we can have him sell these. Alright, who's this? Tara Lee. Alright, let's go ahead and buy. In one of my games, I tried to buy from here and it kept glitching. I don't know if it was this one or another one, but hopefully it's not this one. I'd be a little upset if it was. And then, you know what? We should just meet up with him. Oh, nope. It wasn't this one. Must be. Alright, so we don't need these. So I'm going to go ahead and sell them. My timer is going off. I'm not ready yet, so... I'm going to go ahead and consign these just so we can make some money because we definitely could use it. Oh, you know what? I should have bought from there. Alright. It's not even going. What are you talking about? You've lost your mind. Alright. He wants to go jogging. We should really get him to do that, too. That's what it sounds like. Alright. Let's see. What do we want? Um, hmm, 
I don't think we really want any of this. All right, that's fine. Let's go ahead and get him to share the cooking tips. We're going to follow him on over because she is just taking care of the babies as of right now. She's actually got Charity in a good mood, so that's fine. And then she's going to go ahead and take care of Niklaus, but um, we have to give her a couple more interactions in a bit. But I'm going to wait until she picks him up so I can just get them all out of the way and then tell her what to do after she takes care of him. And then I will go ahead and send Gino home after he does this. So this video will probably be a bit long, but I want to get him home before before I stop today. So, Alright Gino, just hold on a second. Let me jump over to Bonnie for a second just to give her what she needs to do. So let's go ahead and have you snuggle Niklaus and then go ahead and play with him. Go ahead and snuggle him. You can put him back in there. Then you can come over here, take a bath. Then you can come in here, eat the leftovers. That should be good until we get home with um, Gino. I'm going to allow him to go. Where are we headed to, buddy? The pool? We're headed to the pool? Okay. We actually don't think have been here to the pool yet, so... Um... Alright, where is this guy? Do you even know? Are you sure he's here? Um... Standing here is not meaning he's here, just so you know. Is this him? Yeah. Looks like he's in the bathroom, so that's probably what he's waiting on. Which is fine. Go ahead and share your cooking tips with him. That way we can get this done and out of the way. She's still taking just taking care of Niklaus, so we still have time. And this lot is taking forever to load up. I actually want to see what it looked like because I've never seen it. I love this bathroom. If I ever came, if I ever come back here, I'm gonna save this as a pattern so I can use it in some of my other places. Because that would be really nice. Okay, so it says, The conversation between you and Camillo Mancini was full of great tips and cooking secrets. It's a shame the local cooking channel wasn't recording it for broadcast. Head home to prepare some delicious with your Im something delicious with your improved cooking abilities. Alright, so once he gets home, I will go ahead and stop for this episode. I actually had a great time with this one. It was really exciting there with the cheating and all. Um, so I had a good time. And I normal, some of mine are just getting to the point where I'm getting bored. But this one was fun. I had fun because we got birthdays done. And now we got more birthdays today. And we had the, opp we had the almost the possibility of someone getting accused of cheating for no apparent reason. And it was really just fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys had as much fun as I did. Because I know I had a good a good time wa um, playing this. And I hope you guys continue to watch my videos. Um, I'm probably saying that a lot. Uh, <laughs> now I'm just paying attention to it. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next one. And in the next one, we will be celebrating Charity and Niklaus' birthday. The cats, we will start trying to teach them all the hunting skill because they could start bringing in some money. Hopefully, we can get Gino topped up on his career. And we're going to get the baby's paint, um, portraits painted by Bonnie. And then hopefully, Gino, short after that, will be able to paint hers. So again, thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thanks so much.